When I got the phone call about winning the Stockholm Water Prize, I was uh, stunned and I was speechless. And I know people that know me are going to find that hard to believe. But I was very honored to be part of a list of such distinguished past winners. The, the prize is known the world over. And it calls attention to the most important issues around water in the 21st century. And for me, that is water quality. Water quality and the pollution of our, our water systems around the world really affects our health. And I think this is an issue that um, does deserve the attention of the Stockholm Water Prize. You know, you have a lot of emotions when you hear that you've won such a prestigious prize. And I have to say, I, I felt quite humbled. Because what I'm most proud of is the interaction with my international colleagues. Uh, the professionals around the world that work in health-related water microbiology. They are passionate scientists. And they work so hard to address the water quality problems in their own backyards, in their own countries. I'm very proud that I'm part of this community. And I feel like we're really making a difference. In the future, I want to expand what I've been doing my whole career, and that is expand water diagnostics for t the, the testing of water and understanding of water pollution. And if we're testing the water quality and we know where the highest risks are, where the viruses are, where the parasites are, we can spend our dollar on the most important areas first. This is a long-term goal. We're talking about 20, 30, 40 years. We're talking of, about billions and billions of dollars being spent to restore our infrastructure. But we've got to get sewage out of our, our water systems. We've got to build wastewater treatment plants. The future is about resource recovery. So moving from sewage treatment to a wastewater system that recovers water, recovers nutrients, or recovers energy. That's going to be the future. But we can never lose our primary goal. And that is that wastewater treatment is about protection of public health. That is removal of contaminants of concern. And uh, that's going to be uh, my effort in the future to work, keep working with the Global Water Pathogens Project, which is a global effort to put together data and information create knowledge for people making decisions about the various types of pathogens, hundreds of pathogens that can be found in sewage, their risks, their persistence, and our ability to control those uh, using some of the new sanitation technologies. The Stockholm Water Prize is such an important opportunity because it shines a light on the important water problems around the globe. They say water is life, but water quality is health. To me, we must address the water quality and quality issues of the 21st century if we are going to protect the biohealth of the planet in the future.